after DMZ4, and Nero has been gifted the Neon Devil May Cry sign from Dante, which is actually a detail that's not mentioned in the game, but in a novelization. So Nero uses it to set up his own mobile demon hunting agency, and that's how our story begins. You'll find that there's a lot of new stuff. You'll be able to catch a couple hints as to what they'll be capable of if you pay careful attention to the gameplay in the trailer, but you can look forward to hearing more details in games so that it's quality. So we chose to make it with a photorealistic graphics style. We found though that without the proper care, photorealism combined with gaming animation can lead to what I refer to as an uncanny valley of action. So we put a lot of effort in to ensure that the game would still play with that tight Capcom play control, but still feel at home with realistic graphics. We'd love for fans to pay careful attention to how that feels. We eventually did follow through with that three years ago, however. And at that point, lots of the dev members won for 10 years.